close to starting time. Illinois bred three-year-old trotters lining up behind the starting gate for tonight's seventh race. It's the Irwin F. Dargart Memorial. Gate is rolling at Hawthorne. Here they come. They're up and trotting. Fox Valley Cairo, Romantic Warrior driving out. Good boy showing speed towards the inside, Mr. Mizzou. Lou's Dab up on the outside, fifth. Coming away, sixth, Marshall Lou. And then it's Chuchi and Lou's Lancelot at the end. And around the turn and on to the back stretch from the outside, Fox Valley Cairo takes the lead. Romantic Warrior racing second, looking to drop in third. Good boy. Now Good Boy's off stride, off stride, Good Boy. On the back stretch they go. Your leader, Fox Valley Cairo, Romantic Warrior, second, two and a half, three. Mr. Mizzou is third. Lou's Dob fourth, six and a half behind the leader. Two more back to Marshall Lou. Followed up by Chuchi, Lou's Lancelot. Far back off stride, still good boy. They drive over to the half and they take tight order. It's Fox Valley Cairo leading the way. Now here's Luz Dobb driving up alongside second off a half, 57 and four. As they move around the turn, Luz Dobb rushing up now to take the lead. It's Luz Dobb to the front. Fox Valley Cairo now second, Romantic Warrior third. Mr. Mizzou is fourth. In fifth around the turn, Marshall Lou, that one tips to the outside. Three more back to Chuchi. Then it's Luz Lancelot, far back out of it, good boy. Three-year-old Illinois Brett Trotter's turn for the money, and Luz Dobb tells him all, catch me if you can. In the stretch, Luz Dobb leads two and a half, three lengths. Fox Valley Cairo trying to re-rally second. Romantic Warrior now tips to the outside third. Inside, Mr. Mizzou fourth, and on the outside fifth, Marshall Lou, a little more than a 16th ago. Luz Dobb leads Fox Valley Cairo coming on again. Luz Dobb with Fox Valley Cairo. They're coming to the finish. Luz Dobb, Fox Valley Cairo surging. It's tight. Luz Dobb, Fox Valley Cairo very tight. Far back to Romantic Warrior, Mr. Mizzou fourth. Tight photo in the Irwin F. Diger Memorial at Hawthorne.
Returning the unofficial winner, six, Lou's Dob. Lou's Dob is owned by Flacco Family Farms, Limited Liability Corporation. All Right Racing, Limited Liability Corporation. Steve Searle, the winning trainer. Casey Leonard, the winning driver. Lou's Dob is an Illinois bred three-year-old gelding by Lou's legacy of the brand's gold chip mare bands, one I'd love. Lou's Dob is bred in Illinois by Flacco Family Farms, Limited Liability Corporation. It's still unofficial. Luz Dab uh, won here last year as a two-year-old and now wins tonight as a three-year-old. Back-to-back winners on Night of Champions for Luz Dab. And we're down here with winning trainer Steve Searle. And Steve, the first edition of this race earlier on in the year, you couldn't have had worse luck. It was a flat tire and then a break at the start. But then after that, Lou's Dobb really seems to have figured things out. It was good races at Springfield, good races at Ducoin, then coming back here. What kind of turned things around for this horse? Uh, we actually had some bad luck with his foot. He got an abscess in his foot, and uh, he went to pacing the night that he was in the other night of champions. And uh, then we took him to the fair, and he was doing really well, but his foot still hurt, and he was on top by 27 lengths, and he made a break, and that was a heartbreaker. But my wife works really hard on him. Everybody help, works really hard on him. And uh, things have uh, kind of turned her back around for him. He, he's a great horse, a really good horse. Yeah, and he has been solid on the year. Eight victories on the year. And we saw him race really well down in Springfield. And owner Bill Wright was down there. And, and you could see just, just how much joy he had with winning there. And then going to DuCoin and doing it again and seeing them come out there. I know they couldn't make it up here tonight. But just great supporters of racing in Illinois. How nice is it to win for great owners like that? You know what, I'm very blessed to have really good owners. Uh, the Wrights, the Flaccos, I mean, I could sit here and name off 10 other people, but, you know, they're our backbone of our stable, and God bless them. They, they support us. When things are crappy, they still support us, and when things are good, they support us, so it's it's a good deal. Yeah, and that's one of the things you have to go through because you do have the ups and downs like, like you mentioned earlier on in the year. Things didn't work out well, but how nice was it, especially this year, to get that second shot, get that shot again at Night of Champions and get that victory tonight? Yeah, it, it feels good that he, he kind of redeemed himself. It wasn't his fault before, but, you know, it happens. That's why they make a race, right? Well, it definitely worked out well. Congratulations, Steve. Nice victory with Lou's Dobb. All right, thank you very much. You got it. Trainer